What are ODOT crews doing now to prepare? Uh, right now we're kind of in the wait section. Um, so we have already pre-treated the roads. Um, so we've already laid that liquid deister down as a first defense. And now we wait until the snow comes <laughs> or ice or whatever. It keeps changing the prediction. So whatever comes is how we'll then treat the roads. What challenges have crews been facing um, well, due to the pandemic and then the lack of snowfall this winter season? Yeah. Um, so honestly, we're kind of bummed. Um, our snowfall drivers love to be out there plowing snow. So kind of sad that we haven't had any major storms come through. Um, so they are out there uh, ready to go, though. So we've got all our crews ready. We have all the salt ready, all the liquid de-icers. Um, so as the storm comes, whether it's the freezing rain or snow, um, our crews are ready to respond to that harbor need be. Um, one of the things you kind of mentioned, complications due to the pandemic. Um, so one of the things that we've prepared for this year that is new um, is we have separated our shifts um, so we have 12 hour shifts during snow and ice so they can do around the clock coverage. So we separated them into physically different areas of the garage. Um, so we're hoping to, you know, stop any cross contamination of any germs. Um, and then if a shift were to catch the coronavirus um, and not be able to work, we do have different crews that are available to um, kind of shift what their coverage area is to make sure that we're still clearing all the roads that people can still drive on. If drivers see an ODOT crew on the roads, what should they do? Um, please give them room to work. They are giant vehicles, ice plowing and laying the liquid the icers and the salt. Um, so if you see a plow truck or one of our brine tankers, please give them room to work. Um, they are typically going slower than normal traffic, so just have some patience if you do get stuck behind one, and try not to pass them. Some of our crows do have wing plows on the side of them. Um, that's really helpful for clearing shoulders or additional lanes, um, but it can be kind of hard to see as a driver, so just please make sure that there is not a wing plow down before you try to pass if you need to pass. How is ODOT monitoring the road conditions during this time? Yeah, so we, um, all of our managers watch the predictions. Um, so as the forecast keeps changing, they're watching and making sure that we're adjusting to that. Once our crews do go out on the road, um, we have some technology in the trucks that kind of report what conditions are out there, what the truck drivers are seeing, and then we can adjust our game plan based on that um and then each of the truck drivers do have radios so if for example northern lucas county is getting more snow they can call that in and we'll put more crews up there to help clear those roads would you say there's going to be a surplus of salt um uh this for this winter because there hasn't been that much snow um so we have a salt contract um, so throughout the entire winter, we're continuing to restock the supply that we have. Um, so even though we haven't used that much, we're still going to get more shipments in so that we can always have enough for any storm that happens. Um, that said, if we get to the end of the season and we haven't used all the salt, which is very likely, um, we keep that salt for the next year. So it doesn't go to waste. It'll just be the salt that we use next year when we have snow and ice. What would be your advice to any driver that's going to be out on the roads during the snow event? Um, just make sure that you're giving yourself some extra time to get to your destination. Roads could be slick, only to be driving slower. It also takes you more time and distance to slow down as well as speed up. Um, just, and make sure that you're leaving that space between you and the vehicle in front of you. That way, if they need to react, you can also have that time to react. Rebecca D'Angelo of ODOT, thank you for your time.